Hey guys, what can I get for you? I'd like a decaf 360 calories, please. All right. Mm. All right, hello. Uh, I almost forgot to do something. Weird, I thought I had this extracted already. Why do I keep having to open it? Um, I'm just gonna track to desktop real quick. There we go. Don't worry about that anymore. Fuck. Uh, delete that too. Oh. Let me just make sure I, no one can see Skype, because I may need to be doing oh. something. Okay, yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Let me just make sure I, no one can see Skype, because... Um, the double, wait, do we really have double Aegis? Uh, I think it was unintentional, like, I'm, I think the first game, like, we were just so far ahead it didn't matter. In the second game, like, it got so long that, like, we were struggling to figure out what to buy, and we kind of just thought we were going to lose the game, and we ended up turning it back around, but... Um, it was pretty much unintentional, let me just put it that way. I wasn't watching 4PL. I did catch like the very end where like, I'm not quite sure what like, uh, AAA won. I kind of expected that because I've heard, uh, AAA has been doing crazy, crazy well. Have you ever... I don't want to know what this word is, so I'm just going to skip this question. Um, major in Econ? Yeah, I mean, a AAA is really, really strong, which is why, uh... Oh shit, when did my Q pop? Um, okay, whatever. I'm good. That's good. I mean, fast Q pops are better. Oh, okay. So I love my R RM. I talked about this guy before. Um, I'm hoping he doesn't 
beat horribly this game. But uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, let me go ahead and ban standard jungle bans when I go mid. Uh, what's, what's looking like is top lane wants to pick a very, very specific champion. I think the champion's Nidalee, actually, in the current bans. Let me look at the third ban and see if I can figure out what, what champion is. And if, following bans, you just look for counters. You can kind of find the kind of correlation, whether or not the first pick plays a certain lane, or what he wants to specialize in, like, in terms of bans. So from these bans, I can kind of think that he's going to be playing top lane. And with top lane, I see the least in ban, so I'm just gonna immediately just go for a Nidalee ban and see if that if I predicted him well. I'm gonna go and head and find out once we get into game. Oh, it's actually, oh, it's Poppy, it's Poppy Top, fuck, okay, so I'm, I predicted wrong, uh, I forgot people are starting to play Poppy Top a lot, but Love My Arm actually picks a really strong champion against Poppy, um, hmm, I'm gonna go ahead and play Anivia, oh, usually I warm up with Cat, but I'm really, like, I really, really wanna play Anivia today. Um, the reason why I like um, Udyr is Poppy's passive like prevents large bursts from doing a lot of damage to her. But Udyr has like tiny bursts. Like his uh, his uh, tiger stance is like a a dot that ticks down. And so what happens is the passive doesn't actually work on stuff that that hits in tiny bursts. Stuff like Rumble uh, like goes through Poppy's passive. Mm. Alright, cool. Let me quickly up. I just got an overlay from OD, so let me quickly up. Oh, go in and open that. Close some stuff real quick. I have vo oh, my volume is just dangerously low. Okay. I was wondering why I couldn't hear anything. Do you, would you mind playing the call? I can't play the call on this account. How are you doing? Pretty well. Um, quickly close some stuff real quick. I think go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and double check to see if Crows passed me last night. Um, he's still a couple six points away. Uh, Void hasn't played either. Okay, so, practicing a tougher handover. I mean, we're playing on it, but oh shit. Oh, uh, Talon mid really, really sucks. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I switch to my armor page with move speed. I'm gonna go ahead and, and pick up uh, armor for this matchup. I'm gonna start cloth five as well. Um, well, why even need meditate? Uh, let me go ahead and max that. Yeah, what the heck? This is no AP. Oh, Poppy does almost all magic damage. Never mind. Mm. Yeah, like we're practicing, but we don't uh, stream scrims. Or we will be practicing. We just got back from San Francisco, so we're kind of busy with a little bit of work. We'll probably we start practicing around uh, Wednesday, th Wednesday. Hopefully, maybe tonight or Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. All of those days. But I'm assuming this is like Kashin Shin or someone, but he should be higher rated if it is. But Talon Mid is really, really good against a lot of APs. This is one of them. I don't stream. Um, I really don't feel like like my team decided that we're not streaming scrims, and I kind of like I'm fine with that. Um, it sucks that I can't get like viewers. The viewers can't get watch my my screen my uh, scrims and stuff, but. I mean, we're, we're, we're playing to win, and we try to hide, like, what we're practicing and whatnot. Um, and while other teams may have, like, all this time to practice, so they can go ahead and, and stream, like, every scrim they do, because they scrim, like, like, 15 times a day for, like, seven, six, five days a week. 
uh, we're not, we don't have that kind of availability. And so we scrim less than most teams, but we, we try to scrim like more efficiently. And also with that efficiency, we have to be able to not have people watching and knowing what we play. Um, it's it's just a, a, pre, a, a something that my team decided on, and I'm I, I will back my team 100% on it. Oh my god, I messed up. Oh, I was supposed to get good class five, and I was talking. Oh, okay, whatever. I should be still be fine. I should still be okay, but just I now I'm putting a lot of risk on my laney phase, which is never smart. Never, never smart. Hmm. Looks like uh, Warwick's just going to be starting red. And this is a smart start for Warwick's now, because a lot of Warwick's tend to start red. And it's really smart because if they do blue and then try to get to red, and they start blue and just run to the red, um, Warwick's like not strong enough at dueling to the point where he can peel people off the red. But if he starts red, like, if he gets counter jungle that blue, uh, with red buff, he might actually be able to do something. Go ahead and stun that while running back to lane. Crips, Crips split pretty favorably for me. He's running full MR, which is, which is what I expected, like. Oh, wow. Okay, so I missed two CS going in. Um, first game of the day. Hopefully, won't miss too much more. It's armor, MR, he has 2190. And that's all, I can tell all of that from just looking at his rune page very, very quickly. Go ahead and try to see if I can get some auto harassing on him. Eesh. I thought he was going to go left, but I actually ended up pushing my wave there, which is not what I wanted to do. I, I, I'm not even running Meditation or MP5 this game, so be very careful with how much mana I spend in lane, because I don't have like a big mana pool to be able to throw around in the laning phase, or like big mana regen at all. Ow. Ah, the harass. And so I tend to just try to harass him a lot early, because, uh, once it gets later, when he gets more levels, I might not even be able to harass him too much. Like, he may be able to get me inside the, uh, the E that he does. Let me go ahead and just try to throw shit at him. So I can tell pretty much based on his, uh, the damage on his rake is that he's skilled two points in the rake. And I'm assuming, uh, one point into Q as well, or one point into E. But he's not going to go harass me till about level 4. That's a pretty safe assumption. Because you really need, like, all the abilities to start harassing with E. I just dodged that, and he just hits 4. So you may see a lot of, like, him jumping on me to harass pretty soon. I'm going to not skill Wall right now, because I don't think Wall will help me in this lane. And you see, Ivory burnt through two health pots. Just with auto attacks. Let me actually go behind this. Uh, I actually missed the hit, but I got two CS with that frost ball, and that's really kind of what I was aiming for. And the hit was just going to be uh, okay if I got it, but that's super detrimental if I didn't. Go throw some more autos at this guy. I'm waiting for him to jump on me, actually. So I actually burned his final health pot without using any of my own. So maybe I didn't even need to start Cloth 5, if he's going to play like this. Um, I'm 
Whoa! I didn't hit him with the... Oh my god, I didn't hit him with the, the stun part portion. And that sucks. But uh, I think I can kill him now. With the, with one stun. Uh, my top lane die? Really? Oh, shit. Okay, so I just dodge away. But top lane dies to a jungle gank. Fine. Wow, and I don't curve that ball correctly, so I actually don't get the kill there. Had I curved it more toward the inside, that would have been fine. I'm just gonna run out here real quick. Go ahead and put some damage on them. I know I can have killed them with, with uh, whatchamacallit, with uh, Ignite, so I didn't even bother igniting him there. It would've just been a waste of Ignite. And as you can see, I'm kind of just putting pressure on mid lane, and I'm dodging all these jungle ganks as well. And jung jungle actually comes in to, uh... oh my god, was it in range for that? That's fine. Uh, I, I, I wanted to jump in and, and ignite them plus E, but I wasn't in range for the ignite. Uh, but it's okay. He actually comes in melee range and I kill him with ignite because he's, a, he's, he's not, not, not the brightest bull. But, um, I lucked out there. I really shouldn't have just died. And that sucks, but it's fine. I'm hoping that's a kill, actually. Yeah, that is a kill. Really good job by uh, Love Arm. He's actually going gold for five and still winning the lane. That's how you know the matchup is really good for you, dear. Or, or for top lanes, if they can go gold for five and still win. Um, you see Vayne with the the weird ass uh, Valentine skin. It's not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and look to shove this lane because I kind of feel like shoving it. Oh. Oh man, I did that wrong. Okay, so the reason why I shove lane at around 7 minutes is because usually my jungler starts blue. And I like to shove lane and then be able to go get blue. But, I mean, it should still end up to be okay. Fucking Valkyrie in, oh my god. Okay, well I was trying to snow, uh, snowball to try to predict where she'd go, but... She didn't even decide to flash. She's, she knew she was like 100% dead. Um, and that's good for me. Uh, it's the free assist there. Phantoms comes to me. I actually see he's 6, which is good for me. That, that, that tells me that I can probably get a pretty good uh, gank off soon. If he comes middle. Go ahead and put some damage on him there. Ugh. Ow, my ball turned invisible. I had no idea where it went. Alright, whatever. Um, I see my blue is up, so I should probably go ahead and grab blue as soon as Warwick lets me get it. Oh my god, I might be dead here. Oh. So I was just going to shove mid and then go back, but it turns out that I can't even shove mid. Um, hmm. This might be a game where I might consider going uh, Rod of Ages into Frozen Heart, just because I really, really fucking hate the, the double AD junglers that they have. I'm going to go ahead and, and start running to Warwick right now, and he knows I'll be coming, so he starts to do wolves first. You see, Love RM actually like stabilizing the lane. He's only going for last hits, and he's going to harass R Rinse if he ever goes up, which is very smart. I see uh, they actually give mid blue, which is just smart by them. Smart by them. That Talon can't beat me unless he has blue. If I have blue, so I go ahead and push up. I actually see uh, see him coming bottom. So what I'm gonna do is I know he's bottom to force the other mid laner. Uh, to come into lane, you just shove mid really, really hard. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and shove mid. Force him into mid as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. 
and you see Nocturne comes to cover, but Warwick is actually bottom, so they can actually look to turn here if they don't get... Yeah, yeah, so they actually look to turn, but it looks like the turn is not effective. Go ahead and just try to put some damage on them. Nothing too big, but... Oh, I tried to predict his path, and I don't predict it correctly, and he gets a double kill. Oh my god, that's not good for me. Go ahead and take his blue wraith. And Talon's still bottom, so I'm just going to keep shoving mid as fast as possible. Wow, I actually don't even hit the catapult minion correctly. But I'm going to keep trying to shove mid. No! Okay, this, that stuff actually does a lot of damage. So, as uh, Talon has been bottom, I've been shoving mid like crazy. Uh, so, I've got the huge CS lead, or I should have like a pretty sizable CS lead, but he picks up a double kill, and I think he got the kill mid as well. No, he got an assist mid, but that's still really, really bad for me. He actually has a BF sword already. Uh, just very, very bad for me. So, I think I'm just going to have to push up and then lead the lane as soon as I push. Cause I don't want to deal with, with with a fed talent right now as an AP carry with only 13 armor. Plus 12 armor actually. He has enough uh, to actually have his W clear in one hit, which is bad news for me. Um, I'm gonna actually go ahead and buy cloth armor. And some health pots. And the cloth armor is just to negate his a little bit of his damage. Uh, I'm not sure how much armor pen he's running. Oh my god. Okay, so th there's no way to get that. Rinse is actually coming bottom, so we have to back out. Five or bottom. Top should be trying to shove out. My blue buff is actually almost out. But talent is middle. They put some damage on Talon right there. The, the good thing about Talon that that you should know is that his his E cooldown is retardedly long early. So as long as he doesn't have multiple levels into it, you'll be you'll be fine in terms of being able to harass after it. So I'm just gonna put in some damage on him. Actually looking to zone him now. I know... Oh, he, he might look to jump on me soon. Let's go ahead and back out a little bit. And I just use my wall to control his movement and put some more damage on him. I don't know how much I can do this. I know uh, Nocturne might be mid soon. So I think I'm just going to shove out this wave. Let's back out. Yes, I go ahead and look to do that. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to sell my potions to be able to pull off uh, getting Rod of Ages. Well, actually, I'm too far away, regardless of what I do. Um, I might just look to get Sork Shoes. Well, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get that, not Sork Shoes. I'm going to go ahead and buy two wards. And that's what I'll turn my cloth armor into now. So it looks like as long as I live, I can kite pretty much this whole team. Um, but living is going to be the big issue. So I just want to get boots too and some easy, well, uh, some easy armor, I guess. I don't know the timer on my blue. It's actually up right now. So I'm going to go ahead and shove my lane and go back. Shoved out, and he'll run mid, or run to blue, sorry. Okay. 
I know mid is oh um, mid's actually mid. Put in some more damage on them. As you can see, I leave the wall to be able to force them back to positioning to, to, toward me, and then I go ahead and uh, do some big damage. Top is missing, so I need to be careful of rinse it. And Nocturnal is top, so he actually doesn't get the kill. It's fine. What the heck happened when I was looking? Okay, so I guess Talon just gets soloed there for. Apparently he got out tab, which is really funny. Unfortunate, but funny. I go ahead and push in mid lane. Oh, top actually dies. Oh, I know what I want. I know they're unless they're Nocturne as blue right now. I think their blue is just spawn, so I can go in and look to look to clear it right now. No, nope, okay. So it's down, which means I think Nocturne had it top lane when I was looking, and I just didn't see it. I'm gonna go ahead and finish off my Rod of Ages. I'm not gonna go for a tier build because I think in team fights I won't even last long enough to use all my mana because everyone should be focusing me. Like all four people on their team, five people on their team should be stacking on me and hope I hoping I die or hope I die really fast because if they don't kill me fast, they have a potential to be kited really easily by me. Uh, I look at item levels. Mostly, most of the item levels are pretty good, except for Nocturne's 4-1. And that's really where the problem is right now, um, is Nocturne. Not quite sure what we're planning on doing about him, but he's very, very strong right now. Uh, if Drag is soon, I need to go ahead and place a ward on this side. This is, a, this is an important side of Drag to ward correctly. Go ahead and just wall this off so you can't get cross. Uh, he's actually mid with Talon right now. As you can see, I don't actually go go to try to get the E, because I just saw Nocturne in the area. So it's going to be really pretty risky for me if, had I tried to go in on that. I see the Wraith Camp is still up. I still have no eyes on Nocturne. Drags in one minute. I ping top because I know that's where Nocturne is. I'm gonna try to put some damage in on on uh, him bef right before uh, drag spawns. What the? F ah, I I misplayed that pretty badly. I hope Warwick doesn't die because of that. Cause I I misplayed that so badly. I, I thought I was pressing stun again, but I didn't even get my R there correctly. Ugh. Bad misplays all around. Um, I see Nocturne here. We should be able to pressure for this. It's up now. Okay. Corky actually taking too much damage here. And my blue just... Oof. I have no blue, so this is not good. I have to stay for this, though. I think we should do... We're, like, we're trying to force early because... Um, okay, so I just wall them off so they don't get good positioning on us, which is smart. Oh, if he had gone to stun... Uh, We don't know where Talon is. We do not know where Talon is. I did not want to force a fight without location of Talon. And so actually there's Talon. So we're going to get rolled here. Their whole team, like, I didn't want to fight because I had no mana. Like, this was a really bad time. Really, really bad time to chase. I can't even back out there. God, that com I'm still mad at that combo middle. Hmm. We go ahead and back out here. It looks like we're just gonna give up this tower, almost. Uh, I th I'm i considering rushing Zonius this game, just because if Poppy wants to go on me too. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty 
okay in terms of my my damage at this point. I'm just kind of worried about my survivability, which is why I went Tabby. It's why I decided to go a lot of stuff. And you see, he actually picks up my blue. Hmm. Quickly shoving out mid right here. I'm just going to go in here. I'm going to tell Love RM to go in here. I know Nocturne is here. I don't think they have it awarded either. Oh, I wanted the blue buff. No, why would you take it from me? Um, I didn't get the blue buff there, but we did predict, predict where Nocturne was going to go. Uh, and even if Nocturne wasn't there, I won the blue. So I would have gone there regardless because I knew... I can see their bottom lane. I kind of just assumed that that was where uh, someone would be going. Or if no one was going, then I would have just taken blue. That's what I really mean. Um, our blue's down for five, four minutes. Their blue's down for five minutes. Just trying to put some damage onto the wave. Probably just snowball for damage because snowball does a lot of damage. I don't have to use like 300 mana every wave. Just to be able to push it back. God, I'm the, I, I hope I don't misplay this this gank again. He's actually going top the to gank, which is smart. So I misplayed the gank earlier. Um, I'm gonna shove up mid real quick and actually look to see if I can take Wraith Camp right here. Uh, and it's down, so I can't. I'm gonna go ahead and go back mid. Buy my blasting wall. Or. Grab my Zonias. Uh, I I don't trust how this game is progressing right now. Um, it's still way too close. If I somehow do die in a team fight, it's gonna be because I get gibbed because I don't have a enough armor and I don't have like a Zonias active to for to peel. If like I get initiated on by Alistar or Poppy, because Poppy can just roll through my team and no, they can't CC him. Warwick going full armor because he knows they're all armor. The last hit right there with autos and some spells. Um, I'm kind of worried about how Vayne is, how well Vayne is doing. The 170 CS. I don't really feel like grouping until Dragon's up. I really feel like we should just. Uh, well, we could be going for their red buff actually. Hmm. What the blue wraith? Oh, I kept that on a little bit too long. Vayne's flash is down, so that's really good for our next fight. That means if we catch Vayne, she's pretty much gonna die. Uh, just shove out mid real quick. I have 70 Tilzonias. And 50, I mean. I think I'm just gonna shove up this wave. I see Nocturne's bottom. There's no way I'm gonna die to Nocturne. I can't die 1v1 to uh, Talon because I have 150 armor right now. P uh, Janna thinks we can go get Baron, but I don't have blue buff, so I tell her that there's no way in hell we can do that without me having blue. Uh, love my RM and okay, so both top lanes have their their training force. But our top lane has two gold per five. Oh, this is very risky right now because it looks like. Hmm. Oh, I actually shot that that too early. But I'm gonna wait. Go ahead and keep waiting. Uh, there's a lot of people here. What the hell? I can wall them off. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's bottom. Ow. And this is why I get a lot of armor, because I can go ahead and take main hits. I 
I get the kill there. We could put... Oh, I, I don't have blue. We can't do it. Why do people think... Keep thinking... Keep thinking we can... Or... Why do people keep thinking... Oh my god, I can't speak English right now. Uh, but we can't do Baron. Because, um... Oh! I guess we're still gonna go for it, which is just... I don't think we should do that. Oh my god, I'm getting hit with so much damage. And the main reason why I think we can't do this is because if Poppy rotated to here, I would get screwed. Because I would just get raped. Even with my Zonia's passive, I don't have enough health or mana to have to do enough damage to this thing. Oh, I can't even chill this guy. What am I doing? I'm just going to use Flash Frost for damage. Uh, we luckily pulled that off, but just... Oh. We go ahead and Zonia's. I don't know if this is a good idea. Yeah, I, I just want to back out because... Oh, Corky actually going in. We need to go for... We need to go for Vayne. Where the fuck is Vayne? Uh, so Vayne's dead. I think we're just gonna... Like, that was a good Baron in that we got it, but had Poppy come down earlier... They had no vision of this area, we weren't on the map, so it's a pretty logical assumption that we were going to go ahead and do drag. Well, I feel like it was pretty logical. Um, but I guess they decide he decided he wanted to take towers, so he ended up getting like this tower. But we, we traded tower and some kills for Baron. Or we traded tower for Baron and some kills, so everything worked out for us in the end. I just thought it was a little bit risky. like. If I was playing, I definitely wouldn't have made a call like that. Our blue is done. Uh, I think Nocturne went ahead and took our blue. I think I'm going to go ahead and just kill this. Use all my mana to kill this and go back. I'm going to drag this out real quick. Just to the edge of my uh, thing. And I'm going to go ahead and wall this. Because I have no eyes on the Nocturne. But okay, I clear Dragon and I'm going to go back and buy. I just wanted the global goal for our team. 160 armor, man. This is like the most armor I've ever run on an AP carry ever. Like, this is more armor than I get on Xerath stacking like full, full AP. Oh my god. I ping. Usually, every time Nocturne ganks someone, you want to be able to ping where Nocturne is. It just helps, helps them out a lot. Someone actually shrilly it here. I'm gonna go mid. I have enough damage to be able to take him, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and he gets hit with the stun portion. And I put in some pretty good damage onto him. And the thing about Thurster is you can only sustain yourself if you can get close to the creep wave. And since I'm Anivia, you, you're not getting close to the creep wave. Oh my... Oh my god, I forced the flash! Oh fuck, this isn't good. This is a flash over the wall. Like it. Um, but I think Force is flash, and I saw him doing that. That was pretty funny. Um, but I get my flash forced by Poppy. Uh, luckily, I have a lot of regen from Baron. So I can go ahead and probably stick in the fight. Wh what? Tumbled through the wall. Ah, oh, so stupid. Pretty angry. I don't have blue buffs, so I don't know how how much we're gonna force this. Baron buff is really good for me still, but just I'd rather not force into their base because I feel bad things would happen if we tried to do that, like really bad things. Um, but Corky makes a call to go top and push out top lane. I I like the call. Um, they can counter push mid lane though. Uh, I don't know if it's worth it to lose the map presence that you have, but they decide not to counter push mid, which is good for us. That tumble is so... I'm, I'm pretty angry at that tumble, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god. And actually... It's a really bad play by us. 
How did they get caught? Like I only, I'm only walling them to try to peel them off the tower. Most of the kills there. Uh, Rincent got a kill. Looks like just Rincent. Rincent, Young Mini. Who the hell is Young Mini? Talon got some kills. Oh, Nocturne seven and one. So that's probably our priority uh, right now is keeping Nocturne down. Uh, oh, I keep losing blue. So this might have been a game where I would have, or might have preferred to actually ended up end up going tier. Because I'm, I thought we had a lot of map control, but we've lost like every blue. Yeah, this should be gone. And it is gone. Um, and their blue is gone as well. So I'm not gonna have blue for another couple minutes. Hmm, nothing much I can do about that. I'm gonna see if I can put some damage. I actually have no vision here. Oh, I don't think, I don't think we can get this. Nope, 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 nope. Wow, they did that pretty fucking fast. Rinson has his El Elijahs. Oh, Warwick's kill the ult to death. Forced, uh... Yeah, I could have forced his, his ulti on someone, and then we could have gone to push somewhere else. Let's see if I can... Oh, oh, if I had walled him there, I could have done some, some pretty big damage. That's a bait, that's a bait, that's a bait. I don't I don't want to go anywhere near that. Uh Yummy make a good idea to just get get last whisper, because everyone here has armor. It's like 230 armor. This guy has got like a hundred two hundred armor. I've got 166 armor. So everyone on my team has armor. So he's making a good call going to second item last whisper. Hmm. Nocturne doesn't do much damage here because he decides to build really tanky, which is smart. Um, because outside of the Alistair, no one else is really tanky. Alistair's just kind of their initiator. So with Frozen Mount, he can stick on someone. Uh, the most dangerous targets in the game right now are probably... Uh, it's probably just Poppy. Poppy is very, very dangerous. And I, I forced the, uh, the ulti. But it'll be up in 45 seconds, in 50 seconds. Yep, so fast. Um, Baron's up right now. I don't actually know why we're running in because I have wall in seven seconds. Go ahead and wall him away from me. And I don't even blow Zonia's there, because I don't think we need to. I'm not going to stand there. I feel like I'm just going to die. I flash over, and Nocturne actually goes back, because he realizes that staying on me actually doesn't do anything. Love RM actually picking up a triple there. Hmm. We get an ace and we should just get, get Baron. It looks like everyone focused Warwick with 230 armor, which is just like silly. Oh, I actually get the blue buff there. Yes. It's the only thing I've ever won with Amanivia is a blue buff. I kind of want uh, Baron to kill me here because I want full health, but. Here we go, I'm gonna die right here. Cause I want I want full health. And my team 
Oh! Okay, so that was like the worst idea because my team doesn't actually want to push. It looks like they just want to secure objectives and look to buy and then make another push. So I probably just wasted my egg there. That's, I'm a fucking re- okay, whatever. It's fine. Um, I just won't die. There we go. I don't worry about anything else. In terms of MR and the other team, they have no MR. So I'm not really worried about uh, any kind of thing they, they can play with that. I might have just decided to just go Will. So I think my team scales pretty well with Will. Um, and Will helps me a lot, because I just do a lot of damage. But I do finish up my Rabadons. You see, one bot, one top, we're just gonna fucking roll this in. Oh, you can kill the mini. Force the ult, force the ulti. For there it is, there it is, okay. That's all we needed. Now his ulti's gonna be down for 40 seconds, he can't hold this tower. Almost 100% sure he can't hold. Yeah, okay. So we're right, we get a free hit right here. Look, my team wants to just back to our bottom tower? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. I'm all for that. Uh, with, with this much AP, I do do quite a bit with, with the towers, and my team does a lot. We actually kill Alistar inside this ult. God damn, why? Why? Oh, how the zone is this? Fucking Poppy is so gay. Why do we have- Oh my god. Oh, I actually do kill Vayne there. <laughs> uh, too funny. Oh my, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick up my blue, oh, this might be dangerous, okay, let me, oh fuck, I'm so fucked. I should have told Janet to come with me, because I want, really, really wanted blue. And he was way too low to do anything. Man, this sucks. If I had egg there, I still would have died, but... Okay, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Hmm. I do see people picking up MR now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and finish off this void. I'm gonna buy a Brilliant Elixir here. Porky says he needs 500 gold for Last Whisper. Honestly, with the armor reduction on his E, he really should just be getting cleaver. Um, but last whisper is not bad. Mm, well, in this instance, actually, it is really bad. They have no armor. Oh, we actually catch Rinse in here. Ooh. Ooh. Can we catch? Can we catch more than that? Damn, I blue flash for nothing. But Rinse in does get out. Ah, I blue flash for nothing. This isn't definitely down. I want to push this tower in. We need Corky. Oh, he has no mana. He's not even that close to us either. What the f uh, everyone should have healed by now. Except for Rincent should probably have. I force Alistair's flash right there with really good wall and stun positioning. We just need Corky the poke. Rincent actually comes out because he's very manly.
We just need to slowly chip away at this. I don't have much mana, so I can't really... I have to conserve. Conserve, conserve. Just gonna be taking some pot shots here. Wow. Oh, okay. I zone it while in egg, so I don't think I've ever seen that before. Oh my god. Um, I don't actually know how that happened, to be honest. How did I even get Zonia's while I'm, while I'm egged? Love RM actually can kill this guy. Oh my god, he does so much damage. We should just safely, safely take the bottom and hit. And as soon as we get that, the game's pretty much over. Uh, Cause the next Baron should be coming up within two minutes. We get Baron, they can't force the three in hips down. It's impossible. It's very hard to even keep the base alive with three in hips down. And then you just just back out, just back out. I'm gonna go with Pink Dragon afterwards and tell him to just back. We can just get all this. No, no, fuck, 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 fuck. He is fucking crazy. No, no, oh my god, Baron is up. So Baron is indeed up. Uh, I don't know the time around my blue, because I think we've lost one, two, three, four blues this game. Um, and so I can never tell when it's up. Corky can solo this. I, I tell Corky to get uh, Black Cleaver. He actually listens, which is cool. Because he definitely does not need... Other shit. Ritz is getting boots of swiftness. I can cut this guy off. Ooh, I can cut this guy off. Never mind, never mind. We're just, we just wait for the base to push in, and then we make a play. Unless Uider just wants to solo, then that, that'd be cool too. I don't have vision of him? What the f- Oh my god, why is this team so fucking- like, my team just wants to dive, but we need defense around our back line. Oh my god. It does, I guess it doesn't matter, because their base is fucking dead. Oh, and Corky can cut- I think Corky could die, I think, if he cuts right here. Oh, but he doesn't. So that's GG. Uh, that that like okay. When you have a Nivea and Corky, and you're against Nocturne and Poppy. You really, really need your teammates, like at least three of your teammates, to be protecting you. Three or three to four. So I, ideally, I mean, it worked out okay, but it was very scary because if Corky had got one shot right there, we would have lost the fight easily. I don't know. Stuff worked out pretty well. Uh, Love RM getting massive, massive fucking farm F from his early double double for five, but. Whoops, sorry for banning you. But um, for the most part, I don't know, I'm just gonna ban every link that says Dishini or whatever, or TinyURL. Easy. Um, I guess this is a good good point to go over some chat rules. Uh, don't link, uh, don't try to market stuff on my chat. I'm gonna ban you, 100%. Um, no TinyURL links either. Those are all shady as shit. And I can't trust any of them. Um, 
Additionally, in terms of commercials, what I usually do is I, I play a 90 second commercial as my game ends, and I play a 90 second commercial. Or, I'm probably what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a 90 second commercial as my game ends, and a 30 second commercial on the way into a game. And that way, I play about four, 120 seconds of commercials every hour. I feel like that's pretty pretty gener- I don't know. Like, I feel like it's pretty generous because a lot of times my queue timers are about like tw up, can get up to like 10-20 minutes and so I'm just making the rules right now. I may end up changing them but for now I'm gonna be playing the 90 second commercial momentarily and I'll wait a couple seconds to get this message through and then as the game starts I'll switch it to 30. So give me a second let me just wait for everyone to to hear what I just said and Two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Yep. Did I just download? Ah! I can totally use this. Hmm. It's good, it's good. This is something like my um my organization sent me. And so I oh, that's good. I'll I'll work with that later. Oh um prob actually telling me that wall I did over saved Corky's life. Oh wow, and so I did make the game winning play oh well a, a play in the game that maybe helped us win. I, I don't know if they were gonna win, but That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. I always love doing those. This is Ford Truck Month, and time to join the Stampede, a force made up of the hardest working, best selling trucks in America. Only Ford F Series gives you the most payload, towing, and the best fuel economy. See your local Ford dealer during Truck Month and join the Stampede. Um, how do you counter Heimerdinger mid? You really can't. Um, the Heimerdinger knows what he's doing. I think Heimer mid is like the strongest mid in the game. Arguably the strongest mid. Uh, you could maybe play against it with like Vlad. A lot of stuff that he's shoved away very fast. But um, from what I've seen, a very good Heimerdinger with blue buff should almost ever win. Like, but, or almost ever lose, sorry. Can you play Nidalee? Probably not. I don't own Nidalee. I'm actually... Oh, I actually want to play Nidalee. I get two AD players. Ah. And, and, and like... Ah, it sucks. This is like almost as bad like, as when I get Reginald and like GG on my team. Like, people would think that I would win with like three of those three players that are really good. But what happens is like me, Reggie, and Gigi can really only play one lane. And so we go to the side lanes and we feed horribly. Whoever's mid like has to carry like all these feeding scumbags on the other lanes. Oh. I smart cast everything. I guess we're gonna do this number game, so I'm gonna write down a number actually. Oh, they're not gonna do this. Ah, fuck, I thought they were gonna do a number game where they would guess my number, but I was all ready to write something down too. Oh, 
Oh, I fucking didn't write down. Oh well. We give him Shen. Um, how do I want to play this game out? I really want to play Nidalee now. That someone said that in chat. I was watching um, Babe is a dog on Twitch yesterday last night, really really late. And I was watching them play Nidalee mid with Q maxing, and Paul Buster did that a while back, and I was like. Ah, oh, I wanted to do it. Violence solves everything. But uh, right now, I'll switch back to Cat because I feel like I want to play Cat too. Gonna go ahead and take all this. All right. Oh, I'm so fucked. Is that if either of those two go mid? I would lose the lane horribly. I'm gonna go ahead and ask if that's Man Cloud on the other team. Oh, Erwin! What is this? Erwin is so close to my elo now, too. I might have to be queuing on my main tonight. They pick Ezreal, um... I don't know, I feel like it may have clouds lying to me, but we'll see. Too bad Nihilus, um... His first clear is so fucking bad, like... I get complaints from every jungler about how bad it is. It's worse than Sejuani clear. And so, like, I'm... My jungler's never played Nautilus and started at one buff and not have the other buff gone by the time he gets to it. A large part of the reason is because the shield cooldown is, I think, 25 second base at one is just enormously large. Uh, for, I don't know, like he brings a lot of, like if you can push him to late game, he scales extremely well. It's just getting to late game is an issue for him. Please buy Ezreal, dude. I suck at Ezreal. Oh, actually, my AD Ezreal is not bad. My AP Ezreal, awful, awful. Oh my god, really, really bad. Um, um. I'm gonna get to Morg mid. I've done this matchup before. I actually don't have issues in Morg mid. Like people say Morgana counters Cat. I'm like, she does really well against Cat, but countering it's more that she counters the jungle ganks that help Cat uh snowball. She doesn't exactly counter anything else. I don't cop. I don't. Even, I haven't even installed Vent on this on this laptop yet. I, oh, I do. I do have Vent. Never mind. Uh, fuck. Yeah, I don't have anything. Uh, 
Oh, I... God, never mind, never mind. I can't... Yeah, I can't get on that. What the fuck? I don't know how this is going to work out. Um, top starting blue, which is fine, but I comment about this before, about how if you start blue side, you can get easier, like you can get counter jungle pretty easily. Okay, I have to get out. I'm waiting for a cop to call me right now. Uh, come, 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 come. I, I'm gonna miss one CS, I think. One or two. Creeps, creeps split well, really well for me, actually. So I might not even miss a CS running into this one. Yeah, oh, fuck. I do miss a CS. So, I lied. Um, I still miss a CS, but I don't miss any XP, so I guess that's one good thing. I see this uh, girl actually started her W first. It's kind of strange. It kind of means she's just planning on pushing the whole time. Which is... I mean, I guess it's okay. I'm taking a lot of uh, like random poke. Uh, Morg has definitely an, an easier time with his lane than Cat. Damn. No! If he hit me with a bind there, I would have been... Uh, Okay, I thought you find there. What is this? This is a laugh spam that I'm hearing. Um, CS wise. Why do I have this guy on ignore? I have ignored one guy ever. And this guy is is the guy I've ignored. And I don't remember why I ignored him. But I just remember something happened where. It's <laughs> weird. He still hasn't called me. Whatever. Guess we're not going to Skype for this. Just play it by ear. Um, I'm gonna just be farming here. Nothing much I can do outside farm. This matchup. I may be able to put some pressure like around level four. As you see, I tried to go for some harass because it looks like she's not even bothering with anything. But yeah, she's not even bothering with anything. Really weird. Oh, he has to accept me on Skype. Oh, fuck. Uh, I, I don't want to miss the siesta, so let me... Alright, alright. Let me do that now. Ooh, where's the jungler? Balls? Oh, I can't actually go too far out because if Balls comes out of the side and it hits me with, the stu with anything, his melee slow, like, I would probably die. Just gonna do that to push back the, the wave. Yeah, more just shoving. Um, cops profile picture is really like a Korean girl. Jungling is so nice. I don't even have to like do anything. What? It's like I can just go on the internet and look at stuff while I kill creeps. Jungling is so easy. Is that what you're doing right now? Yeah. I just like a a walk to like different creep zones and win the game. Are you sure you're gonna win this game though, cop? I, I don't know. 
Obviously, I don't lose games, so, I mean... I mean, your ELO says something differently. Yeah, that I take all of your ELO. Wow. Look at how much work I'm doing. Look at this. I'm so good at this game. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know about that. New jungler for Dignitas right here. Meanwhile, Hood Stomp getting stomped bottom. Is he now? Yeah, look at them. Uh, 36 CS to 36? <laughs> oh, but he's MF. What is this? Yeah. What a baddie. Okay. Running Ignite on MF? What? What? Dude, he wants to go all in for it. Don't judge. What? Oh, that was a bad idea by me. Holy shit, I just played super crazy. Um... I'm surprised, yeah, Hood Stomp isn't talking. Dominate called me trash, let's bring him in here too. I don't think you have Dominate's uh, info. Did Dominate just say that to you? I already added him. Dude, Warwick is an easy what? jungler, I'm not gonna lie. Well, no, I'm playing him, because I'm just so good at the game that I can play him perfectly. I, I don't know yeah. about that, cop. Like, Dominate, take notes. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, cop. <laughs> Did you take notes of like Cutie's play then? Yeah. Okay. I learned a lot. Oh shit. <coughs> you know, it's not easy to tell fucking Ezreal, Soraka, dude. They play like pussy. Yeah, it's not easy, dude. Kill them all day. I almost killed him, and then they healed, and then he flashed. Oh. oh I don't want to help him. Come on. Dude, he can do it alone. He's, he's winning the you. fight. Why he's do I have this guy fight. ignored though? I'm so confused. Wait, who do you have ignored? I, I've only ever ignored one person on this account, and it's my top lane I have ignored. Who is that? Joyful Fresh. I don't even know that. He seems like a nice guy. I don't know. Maybe yeah. you know, accident, dude. Maybe, yeah. Clicking the scoreboard. What, what is this cop guy doing? Just Carrying. camping rinse it? Camping rinse it? Getting the easy kills? <laughs> Sounds hard. Stealing blue. Because I'm a good player. Oh no, my game's freezing like earlier! Oh god. Oh, we're gonna lose, Scar. I'm sorry. I've been having really bad freezes lately, and it's starting to happen. Ugh. Do you wanna ult him? Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure. For 23. My APM is so fast that I can ult him before he does anything. I don't know. Damn. That. I broke his. We got this. Get carried. There we go. Uh, St. Vicious time. Take all your CS. Wait, is, is Balls really DC'd? Oh, no, dude, no wonder. Dude, outplayed, outplayed to the maximum. Oh, this man. guy's, he has Soraka and he built Riggles, dude. How do you kill this? I need your farm. Why would you do this to me, cop? I need it. Get out of my lane. I need it. Wait, was Balls there. AFK this whole time? No, he's yeah, DC'd. he's DC'd. <laughs> what the fuck? That's why we oh, were winning. Yeah. I was wondering, I was like, why didn't cop get counter jungled and then... Is he I really level one, that dude? Shit, are you kidding me? Yeah. Dude, too good. I don't know, Shen's not that fast. I don't think Shen could counter during a war like that much. Yeah, I'll just yeah, fight him. Just die, dude. Fight that dude. Work head red. You're, you're... Oh, this is such an unfair game then. Too much outplayed in this game, dude. It's unreal. Yeah. Like, he was so afraid when he saw I was jungling, I just left the game. Th that's yeah, it, cop. That's what I would do. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going deep. That last hit the kill, dude. Attack the turret for it once. That's how you play. That'll last hit that Take my fucking cannon, dude. What's wrong with you? Last hit that cannon. Fucking tax my lane. That's not how you jungle. Get over here. Well, my way. Oh, no. You guys can take that. I'm not going to go into your lane. F that. I want you over here. Anyway. Hey MF, you need a blue buff? Because Katarina sure doesn't. Not really. I mean, sorry. Just say yes. They just yeah, take, take take the blue. Take it with the gold, dude. Let's see if it can outlast at me. I'm just gonna auto attack. Good job. Yeah. 
And if Warhead Stomp dies, he gives Blue a blue buff to Ezreal. I don't care. I don't think it's possible to die to Ezreal, dude. Uh, you never reverse that. Ezreal is so oh, bad. Yeah. You, you never reverse Kitty then. Damn. Big words. Okay. No, he doesn't Big play Solo okay. He plays Solo Q, but he plays like. different accounts. Yeah. 1900. <laughs> Or that, that too. He's pretty, he's pretty down there. Oh, wow. I like how Rick, Rick actually starts playing on this, on this loop. Like, why is this even, this isn't even a video game song, what is this? I'm gonna kill middle, I'm a good player. Well, I just popped the shield, so... Free cool. He wouldn't be able to use it fast enough, anyways. Oh, okay, okay. Going deep. Look how, look how frightened he's gonna be. So good. He really Freedom. just flashed there. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I knew he flashed. That's why I waited. I knew he flashed. I'm taking notes right here. Yeah. He was so frightened. Just like <laughs> shit his pants and flashed away. Oh that was the most hilarious thing I've ever seen. Oh my god. That was the most troll shit ever. <laughs> Dude, so lucky is hard on NA server. I have 2.4k. Hold on, let the creeps come. Where the fuck are the creeps? Kill balls, dude. <laughs> he came back. What? <laughs> There's way too much outplayed in this game, dude. Like, it's unbelievable. Yeah, by cop. I think. You're getting oh, outplayed you're by the you're getting outplayed right there. Now. Why are we all <laughs> dead, dude? There's no creeps. Dude, <laughs> this tower hurts. Alright, I'm killing him, dude. Oh, Morgan's here. So. Oh, Morgana's here, though, dude. Oh, oh stop. Where was the kill? God. What was that? Outplayed. I don't know what that was, dude. I, don't, I just did something really bad. I don't know what it was. Why is Mundo bottom? <laughs> Did I not? I don't know what I just did, dude. But it was oh, really bad. That was so bad. <laughs> that was the best ultimate I've ever seen. Dude, it wasn't up until like right then. When does nah, the second dude. blue come up? It was still a really good ultimate. Oh man. I should be able to get out of this. I like it. Check this out. Thank you. Fuck, dude, we should just wait for the creeps, dude. That shit was not my fault. There wasn't creeps there uh, for like 20 oh fuck, minutes. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh! No! Oh. Next level build. Oh, oh my god! Oh, level 3 Shen just pooped on me. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get out of that, but... Oh my god. Fuck. Cop, I'll play them. That's yeah. a pretty good flash, Cop. Oh my Cobb. god. That was a pretty good flash. Like, I don't know about hey, you, hey, but. Hey, 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 hey. I, I, yeah, I knew that he would get that kill right there. I knew it. <laughs> good stuff. Feeding 80 carry like a good player. The tailwind is, is OP, man. Hey. What's up, cop? I talked to me. Work Shaco in the world. <laughs> cop, where's my blue buff? I need a blue buff to be able to handle more. Where is it? I mean, Robert X Lee is a really good player. It's okay to get out of lane by him. Number one, Porky. <laughs> you had such a good support, too, but like, you just couldn't pull it together. I don't know what's wrong with you. Yeah. Guy that can only play Lux support, and what was the other one? Singe top. Yeah, I mean, Good he was point. the best Lux support I've ever seen. Like, what do you think about that, Skara? He can only play two champions, Lux support and ult and Singe top. How do you feel about That's that? That's all you need to play, like... <laughs> exactly, like... It's a top level player right there. Oh, hey, Mondo, how's it going? Oh, man. Wow, Scar, why are you such a bitch? Oh why? my god! Oh, uh, the tower! The tower! Oh my... You shun fell away from him, you're so scared. Dude, I thought I... 
I couldn't have. I didn't have enough damage to kill him, but I, I could have just shuffled on top of him and killed him. Whatever. Oh my god. Whatever. Best cat, in the world. Best cat in the world. This guy right here. <laughs> I think. Oh. It's good. It's a good thing that Bloodwater got that kill. Oh, look at the CS middle. Oh, baby. <laughs> ah, that's that's rude, Cobb, man. <laughs> Dom ain't learned everything he knew from Rincent. Yep. He's so confused right now. I just got a blue buff, but I, I want this one too. Oh, okay. I'm lying, I don't actually want it. Don't play this. I'm pretty sure blue is better on you than everyone else, dude. You should just be perma blue. I don't want this shit. I don't want to I'm gonna hit it once that more. Last time I had blue buff. My wriggle's so not buff. Wait for the creeps to come to the tower. It's not my fault. Then I did not attack the Ezreal. If my wriggle does not proc, you can have it. Okay, it's all you. That's what I should start doing with Star now. I don't know about yeah. this. I feel like someone's gonna take it from me. Okay, thank you, thank you. Why did you leap over the wall? You're supposed to like throw a dagger at it and I was gonna smite it. Yeah, I know, cause that's uh, why I didn't do that. Cause you're <laughs> shady as shit. <laughs> oh, mob yeah. he stole it. That's the same way that he ganks. He just stands in front of the person for like five seconds and they just tear themselves into flashing like horribly. Three, like three meters away, just flashes. Yeah. He's not safe, but he doesn't anyways. Right, 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 right. Oh god, run. Look, I'll, I'll block him for you. I'll block him. Oh, dragon's up. Okay, good block, good block. Good player, right here. Oh, oh, oh Aurelia yeah, comes in to people. get. I'm busy. The ambush. I'm busy. Can't be asked. Kill his shin. Alright, guys, I'll come now. Please, no. Oh, oh, this guy. Oh, this my guy. God. Bad player. Let's go, dragon. Actually, no, 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 we're going deep. We're going deep. Yeah, hold, yeah, hold someone, dude. Oh yeah, that's sloppy. Hey Sky, you know you're supposed to like dodge those vines, right? Dude, dude, nah. It's not my fault, I thought Cop would take it from me. Whoa, whoa, it. Cop! You're a little bit fucking it. crazy. All you day. just kill him, too. What All day, baby. Doing? Too good, this game. All dude. day, baby. That Ezreal's only worth a hundred gold. <laughs> the fuck? I'll kill this new. All day, baby. You really <laughs> Take this guy, too. I don't know about that. You want to rescue me? You kill him, cop. I don't want him. Skinny, I'll take him. I'll take him. All day. Bring him on. Dude, Come on, as well as dead. Scar this it. game, dude. I don't want to carry him. They what carry me. The only one carrying this game is Bloodwater. Dude, it's because he's the best. It was good. Oh man. <laughs> Where's the ulti cop? Uh, yeah, guys. In guys. 50 mana. Help. Bloodwater. Help. Bloodwater. <laughs> Help. Please. Help. Help. <laughs> dude, God. There we go, there's the flash. I said this room with every spell. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Why is top turret dead? What the fuck? Don't worry, bros. I got this. Please, dear God. But water's not that. Oh my God! <laughs> you okay? Do you handle it? No, I'm okay. I'm good. Oh God, maybe not. Stop blocking me, cop! What the fuck? <laughs> Run! I really, you can't handle him. Can you guys kill dragons so I can get my please? JK games over. <laughs> 
Oh, the game didn't finish? That was a long... I had 3.4k gold. What the heck? There's way like... too much outplay in that game, dude. Like, it's sick, dude. If I just played Warwick all day, I'd hit, like, rank 1. I feel like that would happen. Most gold obviously carried the game. That's all I gotta say. The key up again, key up again. Let's see it. I'm down. I can't get into your games unless Bloodwater plays with me too low. Oh, uh, he's not accepting, dude. I can't get into your game, GG. Oh. Yeah, let's do a queue, cop. It's too late. I'm already in queue. Find someone quick. Oh, you guys already popped? No. Oh, fuck. I popped. Oh, oh I, I just popped, popped just now. Are you serious? Oh, fuck. No, my oh. team sucks, dude. God. This is for drug mug. Oh. If you have, you have a boost, a force made up of the hardest team, working, dude. best selling drugs team? in America. What's your team? I got a pretty bad team. Only Ford F series can be the most payload, towing, and the best <laughs> fuel economy. <laughs> See your local Ford dealer during drug mug and join the stampede. Well, whenever me and Muffin get on a team together, we lose, so. This is Ford Drug oh, Month, and time to like join that. the stampede. A force made up of the hardest working, best selling Dude. drugs in America. Dude, Only Ford F-Series mm -hmm. gives you the most payload, towing, yeah. and the best fuel economy. See your local Ford dealer during Truck Month, and join the oh, stampede. No, that Cop, I'm dropping this call then, because I missed you guys' oh. cue. This is no, Ford Drug Month, and time to join the stampede. A force no, made up of no, the hardest like, working, best selling you. drugs in America. Uh, Only Ford Korean, F-Series Korean gives you the most payload, towing, and the best fuel economy. Okay, okay. I was waiting for commercials to come out, so I was typing. Um, I don't like t talking while commercials are playing because obviously some people have complained about missing stuff, and I don't want people to miss stuff when I'm talking, um, especially if it's kind of important stuff. So when I play ads, I answer questions in chat. That's easily the best way to do it. Um, oh, like I I talk when it says like it gives me this this pop up right here. Um, usually that says everyone's courses are over, so it's very, it's a very easy guideline for me to follow. I'm not quite sure, so when it the exact time is. So my playlist is here. I don't know where Rick. A Why is Rick Ashley on here? Yeah, I'm so confused. Like, hold up, hold up a sec. I can't even like control F on this. Like, is he just under, like, Rick Ashley or something? I don't even know. Like, I was so confused. Can you play as Jolteon? That I cannot do. That Lux mid lane. S cooldowns are too long. Um, hopefully the buff to our E next patch will help a lot. Um, the yeah, if I added to the IPL, uh, I obviously thought it wasn't professional, but I mean, there's a lot of things about the esports that's not professional, so I will hold my. I didn't like it. That's that's as much as I'll go on that. The anyway, AP Kogma, uh, early game not too good. Late game, so so big. Like. Very, very strong. Can you play Ari? I smart cast everything. What did A5 do at IPL? Uh, favorite? I like he uh, Human Rise. Or, like, Tribal Rise, the green reskin that no one has. I can't get it, so... I'm pretty sad. I use Triumphant Rise just because 
I, it's the only skin I have for Rise. I know preference on ethnicity of women that I prefer. Prefer all women. Cat is the best that I pick here? No. Are you gonna Gragas? Um, probably not. Uh, I'm okay with Gragas. I don't know. I've been told my Gragas is not bad, but. Did I play it on this account? No. There's still a lot of champions I don't own on this account. Actually, how much does, uh, does Nidalee cost? So I'm kind of curious. Kinda curious. Why is this? Oh my! Is it like bugged out or something? Yeah, my story is like all over the place right now. Let me see if I can just load any of these. The rest of this stuff. I um, can't even load like the. Lo oh, there we go. So I've loaded the lore. So at least I, I can't I can't buy anything. Oh, are you serious, Sia? Did you pass me? I don't I don't think you did. There's no way. Nope. One more game, see ya, one more game. Yeah, I'm just gonna restart this client, this is fucking stupid. Um... Sorry, talking to some people over Skype. Very, a lot of people very close to my elo, and it's dangerous for me. I'll go ahead and buy Nilly because that's actually a champion I've wanted to have on this account. So, where is that Nidalee at? Alright, alright, easy, easy. Play Lux mid. Uh, no. I can play her mid. It's not too hard. It's just I don't really play her. Uh, I think of Oriana. Strong late game, but the uh, early game kind of lacks in terms of just everything. Uh, I like, I like Jay Wong and Combo Fiend for UMC, UMVC3. Um, how do you level high reduce abilities? You can go, there's a couple ways to do this. Ideally, you want to max W first in lane. Uh, I think I've done like uh, 3300 before. I don't pick up a level of ulti till about 10. But alternatively, you can also get like uh, 2310 to get an early level grenade for jungle, ga jungle ganks. Um, Oh, I'm tapping on the on the desk below because uh, I don't know. I tend to have a hard time keeping my hand still. So there we go. Full ethnicity Chinese American. Do you enjoy Kingdom Hearts? Never played. I like the game though. I like cats so much. Good champion. Oh my god. Uh, that's gonna be a long queue then. God damn. I'm not a Guild Wars 2 fan. I never played the first game. I mean, I like good games, so if it's a good game, I might sh show it out.
I don't know what War Warp Command is. Probably around 100 something. Uh, the fact that you have to ask this question means you don't know my ethnicity. Uh, I am in Q, so unfortunately I answer questions just because I can't, I can't play. And usually I demonstrate this by dragging it down here. CLG lost a goose, I think, or curse. Curse a goose. Uh, how can we help? Um, word of mouth is probably the strongest way to help me. You don't really need to do like Reddit posts or any of those things, or like legal ed or like forum posts or stuff. Just word of mouth. If you like my stream, feel free to, to tell people that it's at least like better than average. Like that. That's cool. Um, aside from that, I'm yeah. That's good. Kind of championship requires skill of master champion. Uh, not so <sighs> stuff with like sh like positional requirement champions, a skill shot champions all require a lot. Like Ezreal takes a lot more work than like let's say MF. Um, I don't prefer any other roles. The other, the other role I might be able to do would be like jungle or top. Um, I'm from College State. Oh, I'm from Houston, Texas, but currently I'm at College Station. Uh, on Cat, I run Armor Yellows and MR Blues to be more tanky early game. I run uh, Magic Pen Reds because that's all our dam moves are, da are magical damage, and on um, Quint I run Move Speed because I like moving fast. And she has one of the highest base moving speeds in the game. Uh, Yi is the highest at 330, and everyone else is like, she's 325, so. No, this is a short ass queue. I get like 25 minutes as I get higher. What's your Twitter? Uh, it's at DignitasScaro. Uh, I don't know about a Facebook page. I might come later, but uh, for now. Uh, yeah. Your runes were cat. Uh, I just said them. What situation do you use Heimer ulti when you're diving? You. That's pretty much it. Can you please play the underwater man? No, I don't own him. Like I don't own a lot of champions' this account. And I'm actually third pick. What the? I have. Let me. Clayky D must be high as hell. Oh no, it just looks like we have. Oh! I might be, I think we have 32300 players right here, and I think this, oh, I'm 2200 actually, I can't even say that. This might be Sia, maybe going for rank 1, we'll see. Yeah, I say like that a lot, I say holy shit a lot. Um, something I'd say, I don't know, quirks. I actually... Like, funny story, like, my brother watches my stream sometimes, especially, uh, and he has a girlfriend, and she doesn't know much English, but she can understand it, kind of, and she doesn't speak much at all. So, my brother was watching, and she, he showed his girlfriend, and he watched for a bit, and, like, so one of the only English words she says is, like, holy shit. And I'm just like, after she told me that, I was like, I'm an awful influence on people.
Why do you have a picture of Sivir on top of your stream page? What? I don't hate Sivir. What? I hate York. If I had a picture of York on my stream page, I'd, I'd crush the stream page. If you're a really college station, we'll donate hundred dollars. Are you? J if you can make it in twenty-five. What? I'm at fucking. I'm gonna be playing the game in twenty. Like still playing the game in twenty-five minutes. I'm. I'm not gonna run out. But I'm definitely in college station. Is English your first language? Yes. You really gave me shake. Wh Who the fuck bans Nidalee? Ah, whatever, whatever. I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. I don't even want to play this game anymore. Like, can we, can we restart? <laughs> oh, I hate having these plans to play champions and be all like pumped up for the champion, and someone's like, no, I just bans it off. We go play Vagar because Vagar is a really good matchup for TF, or at least that's what all the TF players I know tell me. Um, let's just quickly this. That's how Clakey needs to show me the power. Ah. Do you play Ziggs? Uh, not really. I can't play him. Like, he's not too hard to learn. It's just that, like, in terms of, like, positioning, sometimes I might be a little bit off. What song is this? It's a Shin Megami Tensai. Oh, it's a Digital Devil Saga song. Good series. Um, I never played it, but I have friends who give it a uh, thumbs up. Wait, 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 what is this? What is this right here? Who the hell is going top? This is this is pretty close to Han, you know. Is Shaco going top? Like, feels so gimmicky. But if he goes exhaust ignite, like, it's gonna be gimmicky as shit. We'll see. This is a really interesting game.
Soso always runs these really gimmicky summoners top lane, and they only work if like the jungle is really weak and doesn't gank top. But if he does, like their top lane gets set so far behind, because top can just get camped by the jungle with these kind of really shitty summoners. Um, so we have what the f go ahead and buy. God damn. Um, we have pretty good team. We have Olaf top. Uh, Labman's proved that he's already really good with Corky. If I can snowball his lane for him, I'm probably gonna go down and give him a at least a lane gank, like a river gank, probably once to help him get ahead in lane. And once he gets ahead, he's shown to me that he is really really effective at staying ahead. Um. Nubby going top. Uh, looks like a very standard game so far. I'm not quite sure what people are planning on doing. Um, especially because I don't really want to invade a Shaco. Um, not quite sure where this guy is running to. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god! I... Whatever. I... I hope by the lane doesn't get crushed now. Let's just... Let's just say that. Holy sh... So silly. Uh... Oh, it crits me for 164. That's like, oh, it's like a third of my health right there. At the health pot. I already had had the health pot because uh, I took damage bottom and we didn't get anything from it. So please no. Okay, so top gets a kill. Even on those cheesy summoners, he gets a kill. And usually if you get a kill top lane, it's hard to come back from being behind top lane. So I've already talked about how top lane is pretty far behind. Like, it's pretty isolated in terms of uh, just what people go top. Or who goes top. Like, you really need to be around dragon to make good plays. Just gonna shove this real fast. Um, I actually had to pick up W here to be able to clear the wave better. Usually I always pick up stun at 2, especially if, if there's a really strong ganker. I think I, I really think bottom lane is, is screwed now. Because uh of RM's like MF is all early game, but she's so strong in lane, like it's ridiculous. I'm gonna have to just give TF as much farm as he wants. I can't afford to play Risky. Sorry, risky against this uh Shaco. We'll see how this uh, game plays out later, but for now, uh, definitely full defensive mode for me. CS wise, I should be doing very well. Um, I haven't checked CS really. Let me go ahead and check right now. Uh, 21, 24 to 21. So I'm doing very well. Um, at least splitting even with him and staying a little bit ahead actually. Now he's just spamming the wave. Uh, TF is a very strong champion and I have to hope he doesn't snowball bottom too badly. Um, he has a level advantage as well in lane. A large part of this is because I went bottom and I missed almost all the melee minions when I went bottom I think. If you can see right here, I actually don't decide to hit the top minion because I know uh, the tower would want, would hit the top minion immediately after it killed the cannon minion, or uh, not not the tower. The creeps would first hit the top minion, so I don't need to do damage to it the last hit. It. I don't get it, but had I had I hit it, I would have had zero chance to get it. The tower shifted from the middle minion to the bottom minion to the top minion. And that's why I only hit the bottom two minions, the ones that are the farthest away from the tower. Because those are the ones that the minions will attack. Because they attack based on proximity. Uh, that might have been a little bit too in-depth, though. Like, I, 
Um, but, I mean, some people like to watch that, so... Hopefully that was okay to say. Should be able to get this. Oh my god, bottom lane just gave doubles. I should get blue buff here. Man Cloud comes out with the blue? Um, I have 50. Oh my god, what is happening here? Oh, making the big plays with the Lee Sin. Oh my god, what is Shaka doing? Okay, so I have the health pot here. Um, just to be farming. KS Flash is down. Okay, that's good. Mecha actually running into that W right there. Oh, that is so fucking dangerous. Oh, she's so fucking dead. Because Shaka was just in the area. Oh, no. No. Ooh, I don't think I killed him. Maybe I should have needed Flash to get, get another auto in. I would have killed him. But um, I would just went for the chance there. I pushed him out of lane. And that's kind of what I was going for. I was hoping for a kill. But um, if, if I can only push him out of lane, I'm okay with that. Let me just shove the lane really hard while he's uh, going to back. I know I need two Ws to be able to take the, the back line. And so I just W really early and W right here. I'm actually going to see if I can go ahead and take this. Go ahead and take the blue wraith. Uh, I'm really far ahead in terms of where I need to be uh, money-wise. So I can't hold on to this goal. Like, this is too much gold for me to hold on to. I'm going to go ahead and go back and buy some some stuff real quick. I'm going to buy double Dorans. Mainly, I only buy double Dorans because it helps me stay healthy uh, in lane. It gives me a lot of like health with the stats. Also, Vagar's passive is a mini chalice, so it helps you uh, last hit, like, the mana region scales really, really well with Vagar. Better than most champions. I was tempted to pick up a gold for five, though. That was the other option. Also, I'm unsure where Shaco is, so I can't go too far forward. Whoa, what is this guy doing? A little bit crazy. Um, CS-wise, I'm up on CS. I missed the stun there. If he runs back into it, but I could not expect that he would do that. Um, let me go ahead and last hit that. I only put two points. Oh my god, I'm gonna miss this one. Uh, why did tower attack the farthest? Okay, never mind. That was my bad. I I maybe shouldn't have uh auto the bottom one there. So mid is missing. I'm gonna go ahead and call that mid is missing. And ulti is up. So I have two possible ward spots. I can ward here, or I can ward probably over here. I think I want to ward here. My blue just fell too, so I have to be a little bit careful. I, t I tell bottom in the back, and I shove mate to force TF back in the lane. Because I don't want him going bottom to kill my bottom. Uh, I drop blue. Can I kill him? Maybe when my ignite comes up, I can kill him. Ow. CS wise, I'm at 80. He's at 65. Uh, I'm actually surprised Shaco has decided not to gank mid this game. It might may have been that uh, Mankind actually ended up pushing the lane a lot. Um, and because of that, Shaco can't really gank if your lane's super pushed. Like, it's risky for him. Go ahead and just W that. Alright, very easy. Ooh, can I stun this? Can I stun this? I didn't hit him. Fuck! Uh... Oh! That Q bounce!
Here's a Q. Here's a Q. Double kill. Oh, I didn't even need to ulti that. Oh my god, I could be killing more than that. Uh, okay, never mind. Maybe before Shaco like one shots him with the with the bonus damage from backstab, that'd be I would laugh really hard if that happened to him actually. I didn't need to ulti there, yeah. Overestimate or underestimate my own damage. It's because I had Sork Sork shoes and uh, like that makes your damage go up crazy if they don't have much MR. See, take Smith over there, man. Making some shady stuff. Oh, okay, I see Shaco coming. Where's he going? Okay, okay. I was curious, like, I was uh, just wanted to bait him out to actually force the smite so he decloaks and I could just stun him. But he actually doesn't go for it, which is uh, smart on his part. I was kind of hoping he'd be stupid, but. I'm gonna miss the CS. Oh, I missed that CS too. Uh, my Q right now is at 55, which is definitely. It's very good for me. And I just see TF has no mana. Just back, I could probably take this. Alright, and do go ahead and get it over the wall. Um go ahead and one shot this back line. I wanna show up the wave while uh while TF is missing. I think they just did drag. Um I have a weird gold that I thought they just did drag. Um I have a weird gold value right now. I could potentially Hmm. I decide not to go the gold for 5 route. I don't think I need to. I'm just gonna get uh because you can off you can get Kage's pick first and that way you kinda speed up your your way to death fire. But I kinda wanna get codex for the it gives you a lot of AP and the real big thing is the CDR it helps a ton. So right now with uh, blue buff my CDR is at 34%. Like it's really good. Once you shot all of those. There we go, got everything. Go over and play some wards. Careful with Maokai, what? I have enough damage to one-shot TF now. And so if TF pops up in lane somewhere, and I have side of Shaco, I could just go in, all in on TF. The thing about Shaco is I can't afford to ward right here, because he can jump the wall here. So I have to ward pretty far back. Let's say right about here. I think Shaco just gave mid blue, so you have to be careful top. Ooh, I really wanted to go in on that. And so, do I have enough to one shot these range minions? We'll see right now. The answer is no. yes. Oh god, TF is. Oh my god, big plays! Wow, good kick too! Oh, uh, very, very good. And that was like the follow up, the worst way to follow up that. But yeah, Lisa making 